Yo, what's going to family and welcome back to another video. How you guys doing? Hopefully you guys are doing great. And today we're back on the Madden 15 Ultimate Team bringing you guys the player review of 97 overall legend wide receiver Steve Smith Sr. Let's check out the back of this card. This card is 5'9", 98 speed, 93 awareness, 97 catching, 97 elusive, 93 spectacular catch, 86 release. 90 route running, 97 catching in traffic. 2005 NFC Divisional Playoff, Smith caught 12 passes for 218 yards and 2 TDs in a win over Chicago. As we check out the depth chart stats, some stats that stand out to me, that this card has 98 speed, 97 catching, and 97 catching in traffic. Steve Smith is the second fastest card in the game with 98 speed. He is only second to the 99 speed Devin Hester. This card's going for about 200k. I feel that it is a phenomenal slot receiver. When playing with this card, he felt faster than 98 speed. Honestly, he felt really fast. He felt like a 99, even 100 speed at some times. Uh, he always outran the zone, the man coverage, and things like that. With that 98 speed, he always outran everybody on the field. And you will feel it whenever you use this card. With 97 catching in traffic and 97 catching, whenever I threw the ball to this card, even if it was off target being in front of him, behind him, you always see him going for the ball. When the ball's behind him, you'll see him adjust his body to catch the ball. When he's behind, like right there, he would adjust his body to catch the ball for you. And I love that about this card. He always tries and get the ball. With 86 release, I felt it wasn't really an issue because I put him in a slot. And primarily, teams don't really jam the slot receiver. They only jam the wide receiver number one and wide receiver number two. So with his 86 release, it wasn't really an issue for me. So if you do use him in wide receiver number one or number two, keep that in mind. He may get jammed up sometimes. But for me in slot, he really didn't get jammed up much for me at all. Yes, he is 5'9". He does seem short on the field and uh, doesn't really uh, bother me. Because at times he plays big. As you guys can see here in double coverage, he does catch the ball. He does go up for the ball. Whenever he's on the fade route, the streak route, you will see him try and get the ball. That's what I loved about this card. Even though he's 5'9", he played strong, big, and fast. That's what I love this card. He always goes for the ball. He plays bigger than what he really is. To be honest with you guys, I really enjoy this card. It is an, one of the best slot receivers in the game, if not the best. Going for about 200k. If you got the coins, get it. If not, maybe get a Julian Edelman or something like that. Somebody similar. But I think this card is honestly the best slot receiver in the game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new. And let me know who you guys want to review next. I'm signing out. Peace.